This Thanksgiving, don't let a poke, stab, or slice prevent you and your family from enjoying turkey time. We see a lot of turkey cutting injuries. Dr. Sanj Kakar, a Mayo Clinic I'm orthopedic hand surgeon, says Thanksgiving is supposed to be a time dedicated to family, football, and food, but too often it turns into a day of finger and hand injuries. In terms of what happens is that people who aren't familiar with using a knife tend to do it, and their hand slips. And if you actually think about how you're cutting, you, the knife can actually slip and puncture your hand. Dr. Kakar sees patients who have cut tendons or even cut fingers off on Thanksgiving trying to carve a turkey. Well, I think the number one risk uh, factor is alcohol. So if you've been drinking, leave the carving to someone else. Another common cause uh, for injuries is with distraction. So the whole family is gathered around, there's a lot of excitement, the turkey comes out and one can be distracted when you're doing it. That's why he recommends doing the carving in the kitchen, away from distractions, then bringing the sliced turkey to the table. For the Mayo Clinic News Network, I'm Jason Howland.